The movie has been in production for two years, and now people who live in New Providence can watch the film that shares the town's name. The movie about six on six girls basketball in Iowa is out on Amazon. The formal premiere is happening this Friday in Waukee. WHO 13's Roger Riley reports on how this production could affect the future of New Providence's historic roundhouse. The film New Providence is a fictional story looking at the last year of girls six on six basketball in New Providence. It brought back some nostalgia. You know, Friday night, Tuesday nights, that was basketball night and you came to watch the gals. There were times that there were more people at the gals game than the guys games. Here for the last day of filming and it was really fun to see the stands full again watching a six on six basketball game. They took the field of dreams and turned a movie site into a place where people could come by and actually play ball. But here in New Providence, not sure if you're gonna be able to just pick up a ball and come get a shot. Though this film does not have the star power of Kevin Costner in Field of Dreams, could the Roundhouse become a tourist attraction? It has plenty of small town charm. You know, why not uh, have a reenactment of the Everly Union Witten championship game, have those gals get together, something like that. It helps put the Roundhouse on the map for a lot of people. Um, six on six basketball was really special because it was unique to girls and um, I've just talked to people when we, they were here filming and it's, it's just something special and unique that is a bygone era. If you go downstairs, you'll see every class pictured around the cafeteria. He had a, a guy come back uh, about a year and a half ago and he remembers his half court shot that beat Lenahan when he was a kid. The community will premiere the movie here at their summer celebration the last weekend in June. From New Providence, Roger Riley, WHO 13 News. New Providence premieres at the Palms Theaters in Waukee this Friday night at six o'clock. Some of the cast and crew will be on hand for that event. Uh, 